Welcome to FutureCrew.com. Today we're going to be doing a little bit of review on these awesome ViewSonic G tablets running hack software TNT Lite 424 from XDA Developers. But first, today's drink special is Red Bull. Snap into one of these. I actually need some of this. Okay, we're kind of Android fanboys here. We hate Apple. Everything Apple is awful. Oops, there's my laptop. It's Apple. Actually, we don't hate Apple stuff at all. Apple is, um, Apple's cool. I just want to show you these tablets. These tablets run at $379. I think online you can buy them for about $360. Inside of there is a Tegra 2 processor running at 1 gigahertz. Um, it's the ViewSonic G tablet, and the uh, firmware that comes with it totally sucks. So we hacked it off and put on TNT Lite version 424. You can get that at xdadevelopers.com. So let's, um, let me zoom in. That's where editing comes in handy, right? Yeah, the, we're editing it now. <laughs> <laughs> we're online, jackass. <laughs> so here we are. Um, this is the TNT Lite 424, and I just want to show a little bit of the games and things that are on here. Um, for starters, uh, here's a, a game, Pew Pew, that I found the other day. This is a lot like uh, Geometry Wars on the Xbox 360. It's got a lot of like, really cool graphics. When I want to demo, it has controls on the screen, which is nothing new. But I was surprised after playing it a little bit that it's actually pretty easy to play. Like, you get used to the controls on the screen. And I'm, I'm trying to play this around the tripod, so it's going to be kind of difficult. Um, it's just a fast-paced kind of game with a lot of lights and colors. I got some shields down there I got to go get. It gets progressively harder and eventually kicks your ass. At least mine. I'm not that good. Um, you can see the controls down here on the bottom. I got one for thrust and one to, to shoot with. Um, pretty cool stuff. I'm going to demo a few more games on this thing. We're basically doing games today. This is the gaming episode. Um, Sonic. Yay, I'm already playing Sonic. So if anybody is old school and had a, like a Sega from way back in the day, this is a favorite, right? Yeah. Try that. I'm trying to like play it and tape. So pretty cool. Got the um, joystick down here and got my buttons down over here. This emulation is so real that you can even put in like the um, hack codes and stuff and it accepts them for getting into different modes. Um, what other games I got on here? Um, pinball. This is kind of cool. Enable sound. Yeah, really? Play. This is pretty simple. There's just something for the plungers and then you got the paddles. Um, again, once you start playing it, you kind of forget you're actually touching the screen and not using actual joystick buttons or something. Um, pretty cool, I guess, if you like pinball stuff. It'd be really cool if there was uh, the accelerometer. You could do tilting of the table. But I don't know how that would work because you might not be like trying to tilt it at all and it might end up tilting. I don't know. Um, what else have I got on here that I can show? Yeah, today is game day. Um, live wallpaper, yay! And some of the classic games, like um, these types of games, they're just better on a tablet. This this particular tablet, the G tablet, is the 10.1 inch screen, so that's really cool. It just gives a better experience. You're gonna get a tablet. Yeah, I'm running out of time. Screw you too. If you're gonna get a tablet, I would recommend like a 10.1. Those seven inch ones, like I've used those, and it's just it just feels like your phone still. Like it's I don't know. It just it's just not quite there. Um, also, quadrant scores on this baby. Um, whoa! So I'm going to run the quadrant scores really fast. Yay! <laughs> um, 2282 is what I'm getting on the quadrant score. Um, something to keep in mind on this baby is um, if I take and look at the system information on this, you probably can't see this. Maybe you can. But it's only using, the kernel I got on here is, it's Android 2.2, it's some variation of that. Um, it's only using one core, and you can witness this in the system information. The kernel wasn't compiled for multiple cores. So I'm hoping somebody hacks the Honeycomb SDK and puts that up on SDK developer, S, XDA developers, and that we can get the two cores out of this to let fully, fully utilize it. Um, and of course, 
honeycomb would be really nice too. But that just, even with one core, I just wanted to say like how well it does on the benchmarking. And it helps to have multiple tablets too, that you can do this kind of stuff. Um, that is, I think, everything that I wanted to demonstrate. Oh, my assistant over here is showing me that we have to play hockey. <laughs> this is kind of a cool game. Um, I am not going to try the insane again. I just totally got like my ass kicked on that. Wow, really easy. <laughs> Whoa! I think I might be able to win it easy. <laughs> Jackass. Really? You try playing it with it. <laughs> Do not feel like a retard. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Alright, I gotta take it on. I'm sure this is fun for everybody watching. God damn it, give me this. <laughs> I will not be beat by you, Ovechkin. <laughs> Anyway, um, kind of a cool game. Gets boring really fast unless you're trying to play against eight-year-olds, but um, in which you can easily win, hopefully. Um, this does not have a vibrate in the tablet, but whatever. Um, I think that's about. I think that's everything. That's what I kind of wanted to show today. Get to the end of this video, um, fill out the promo code. <laughs> no, there is no promo code. You just lost like ten minutes of your life. You'll never get back. Sixteen forty-nine. <laughs> All right, thanks for watching. All right, everybody, thanks for checking out all my tablet reviews and all the other um, videos on futurecrew.com. And um, I have a new app that I want to show that you just won't see anywhere else, and this is the, um, the pizza application that I just downloaded. It's really good. Dude, I can't do this with a straight so here's my pizza app, <laughs> and it, uh, you can download this from Market, and this particular one I got from uh, Giordano's, but uh, <laughs> I, I'm going to cut very carefully. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Oh, it's fucking delicious. <laughs> this is perfect for college kids that don't want to do the dishes. <laughs> yeah, there's... um. I wouldn't recommend trying this. Wow, this is the most fucktarded thing I've done. It's <laughs> Feel free to leave very um, clever YouTube comments, as YouTube people always do. <laughs> and um, thanks for watching, and be sure to visit futurecrew.com. Try to be sober. Um, that's not how I am right now.